Hey, what's up, everybody? This is Toasty Gamer Boutique. We're here playing Cookie Run Kingdom, and we're going for our three trays of the Tower of Sweet Chaos for the day. Here, we're at tray 101, and we can either go with dash one or dash two. Do I want the coins or the experienced star jellies? And for me, it's a no-brainer. A, this one is 20 keys. The one on the right is 30 keys. I'm going for the experienced star jellies. Oh, yeah. That's going to be perfect for leveling up our cookies, and you can never have too many experienced star jellies. Next, we're moving on to tray 102. Let's see if we can't get the first victory. For this level, you can't have any charge cookies, and you can only have one healing cookie. So we're going to go and switch out our tea night cookie with a cocoa cookie over here that's looking pretty good i mean we've got an average chance of winning i don't i mean i feel like i should level up my uh cocoa cookie here but i think it's okay i'm gonna go with it and hopefully we're gonna be able to get the victory this is 10 searing keys for this level 102 and i'm hoping 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 we can pull off a fierce victory here i've got some pretty good treasures and i've been doing a ton of research and i have my six landmarks which help make my cookie team stronger at the moment, with the bingo that we have going on, you want to do three trays a day for the bingo blossom stamps. That is definitely what I recommend. So usually I save up my keys and I try to make some videos. So I'm going to be sh uh, changing it a little bit lately. Oh my gosh. And speaking of videos, seriously, I've recorded three Cookie Run Kingdom videos lately that the audio doesn't work on it. It's just like a blank video, no audio. So technical difficulties always seem to happen when we're recording, but hopefully the audio is recording right now and we are going to get this victory. Come on, baby. Let's go tray 102 i want to get the victory on this level Woo! yes there we go that is what i'm talking about yas queen here we just crushed it and we got a pretty good victory first win look at all those experienced star jellies along with the beautiful chaos cake pieces here we're crushing it and i'm moving on to the next tray 103 hopefully we can get the victory once again uh we've got some decent opponents here and i feel like we should be able to blow this one out of the park there shouldn't be any reason that we don't win i mean i don't think so good defense here maybe i can just switch one thing afogato and chili uh just don't want to take any chances you know what i mean here it's another 10 keys and i want to get the victory for the cake horde tray 103 Come on. They've got pure vanilla, which kind of scares me because pure vanilla has got some epic healing. But, oh, it's going good. Yeah. Okay. No need to worry. We are crushing this. Ooh, Yas Queen. There we go. Patsang. Getting that victory right there. 103. We crushed it. And we should have our three trays for the day so that we can go ahead and get those blossom stamps for the bingo. I'm wondering, did the, did the treasure chest count at 101-1? Did that treasure chest count for the, bing, the bingo mission? Uh, interesting. Okay, so we do have to do another tray at the Tower of Sweet Chaos. So here, it won't take too long to refresh. Next up, we're going for tray 104. Here, this is going to cost us 10 of the searing keys, and we can have zero charge cookies and only one healing cookie. Uh, we've got pumpkin pie, avocado frost queen, along with cocoa as defense, and uh, a custard cookie in the back as our healer. I think we should be able to get the victory, but you never know. Hopefully, this is going to be strong enough. Let's see how this goes. Hey, keep it going, everybody. If ever you get stuck in the Tower of Sweet Chaos, one of my tips is to go back and play previous levels that you've already won. That way, your searing keys are going to keep on regenerating. It's also going to give you some experienced star jellies as rewards, and you can use those experienced star jellies to level up your cookies and make them even stronger so that you can go ahead and come back and get that victory for whatever level you might be stuck on. Here, things are going good. I'm hoping that we keep our HP pretty high. Looking fantastic. We're about two-thirds of the way through the level. Fingers crossed that we can get this victory. Let's see. Let's see. Taking a little bit of damage. Got a good heal from Custard. Yes, and there's that victory. That's what I'm talking about. Looking fantastic. And we crushed it once again here, getting a ton of experience. Star jellies, some coins, and some of the cake pieces for the beautiful... Uh, 
landmark that we have actually here i want to see did we get the blossom stamps please let it be in the event stack in the event events section there we go we can go ahead and claim those 20 blossom stamps for the day thanks so much for watching make sure to hit that thumbs up button for the like subscribe hit the bell for notifications and stay tuned for more tips tricks and strategies good luck everybody hope to see you soon peace